started the company in 1977 uh, in my hometown of Charlotte, North Carolina. As a CEO, you look at your strategic approach. What is your long-term vision? I guess if, if I've ever had um, a trait in business, it's a dreamer. What you need to do is to realize that what is the most important part of trying to locate a business, does it fit with your culture? Being the CEO, I went to California, St. Louis, Dallas, Orlando. I walked the streets of Tampa. I spoke to the wait people. I rode in taxi cabs. Ask them, what do you think about the Apple? There's where you really hear what's going on. And as a result of that, I felt this was the place we should come. He called and said, hey, I just want to let you know I'm moving the company to Tampa. And uh, I tell people this all the time here. At first, I wasn't really excited about it. But that's probably true no matter where we would have been moving. My wife and I got our house, and I came home one day, and it was, uh, it was in the winter time. She was fixing dinner and had the sliding glass doors open, and I could hear the pool feature running, you know, and, and it was just like a beautiful spring day, and it just hit me. And I said, wow, this, this is what it's about. It's the longest place that my wife and I have lived anywhere. We've been here 18 years, and um, I don't see myself living anywhere helps. You should love the place in which you live. The one thing about Tampa that I love is that out of all the communities in Florida, it's the most thrill community. It's south enough to have all the benefits of Florida that you want, you know, the warm climate and the, and the, the way of life. It's uh, close enough to the big tourist areas in Orlando. You can look at performing arts. You have all the major sports, your schools, you've got access to the water. It has a real sense of community. We are in the path of progress. We're in the path of progress both from where people in our country want to live, and we're in the path of progress when you think about as a global community, the gateway to Latin America. Right? So it's a smart place to be. When we're having global meetings, we've got our teams flying up from Brazil and Costa Rica and Mexico coming in. We've got our guys coming in from Europe, and it's, it's easy to get here. And it's a great destination. I think this is a really unique time for Tampa because we haven't gotten to where we're going to be, but we're not so small that, you know, you got to live here 20 years and tell stories about I remember when. You know, we're at that fork in the road where there are exciting things going.